So, what's up guys? It's been a while. And, well, there's been a few things that have been out there. And one of the things that, of course, goes on during um, the month of June is Pride. Particularly in California, at least. I don't know how Pride works in other parts, but typically during the summer. You know what? Just Pride season. Let's just say that. One of the biggest things that has become an issue, and I know this is going to sound very cliche coming from a white person and let's first just knock out any racial issues whatsoever I'm not saying this you know to be racist or anything like that I'm by now anybody that watches these videos should know I'm far from that being a Marxist you know that is something that I don't subscribe to. You know, I'm at war with white supremacy. I absolutely despise everything that has to do with white nationalism. And I'm about as anti-Trump as well any individual can get. That being said, I wanted to basically bring up this issue that has been very prevalent in the LGBTQ community. Now, recently, in I believe it was Philadelphia, they were raising an alternative flag of the LGBTQ community. And that flag happened to include the black and brown stripes to signify the black and brown, you know, members of the community that have, let's face it, been historically disenfranchised, while, yes, always allowed to be part of the group, not really have always been represented. And this has definitely been a bit of a thing that has caused a little bit of controversy in the LGBTQ community. Now, I myself have, you know, come out as pans. I have always, I've, you know, admitted for a while now that I am a member of the LGBTQ community. And that being as well as being a progressive thinking Californian, it's one of those things where, you know, I didn't really see a problem with this flag. But very shortly, I saw a lot of people raising a lot of stink over this alternative flag. And I really don't see what's so wrong with the black and brown stripe. Primarily, one, because if anything, the black and brown stripe is representative of black and brown people who are part of the community and a lot of people are trying to say well it's not supposed to be about race it's supposed to be about you know da 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 does it really matter we are all fighting the same fight it's all the same struggle really so I don't understand why a lot of people are raising a lot of stink over it now let's also go back a little bit further as well. The black stripe was a, all, was on the flag at one point back in, I believe, the 80s and early 90s when the AIDS epidemic was pretty rampant. And it was basically to signify the people that had in the community that had passed on because of this horrible disease. So... Even if you, whether, which way, whichever way you represent that, that shouldn't, you know, you know, I can, either way you try to really play it off, the black stripe shouldn't even be a controversy at all, considering that, you know, it can be interpreted in different ways. And, you know, ultimately, the, the stripes that were being added, I think, should be added if you ask me personally, I believe that the stripe should be added to the flag as it is simply because it does encompass the, you know, the people from the African American and, you know, other, you know, races of color into that community that have been maybe underrepresented by the flag or even the LGBTQ community in general. Not to say the LGBTQ community has disenfranchised anybody or has underrepresented people, 
but essentially it is stating that, you know, this would be a more symbolic gesture to incorporate, you know, that into the, to incorporate people more equally. Because, you know, whether you like it or not, black people, brown people, you know, they're all part of, you know, there's people of color that are part of this community. And it really shouldn't be that big of a controversy. But then again, this whole situation has shown that even in the LGBT community, there is a little bit of racism that has come out of this. And frankly, if you're, if you're gay, if you're lesbian, queer, trans, whatever the case is, you're fighting for your equal rights. You, your black brother and sister, your Latino brother and sister, your Arab brother and sister, who is part of this community, is fighting for the, is fighting for the same rights. Although you do have to acknowledge the fact that you, if you are white, you do have, and particularly white male, you do have more privilege. I will admit that as a white male of the LGBTQ community. It's one of those things that but it's one of those things where you know you do have to acknowledge that there is a s certain level of privilege that certain people have but we all are fighting the same fight so let those people be represented fairly and not just through the activism not through just open arms but in all aspects and all they're asking for is two additional stripes on a goddamn piece of fabric. Because honestly, does it really matter? Does it really, is, should it, is it really worth causing such a stink over that? Because I don't see the issue with it. And if you honestly have an issue with it, please feel free to comment below. Feel free to tweet at me. At this point, I'm checking my Twitter almost every day, so feel free to send whatever you want to me. So, that's just something I want people to marinate on. And I thought that this was a very interesting subject that was that I came across when I was looking into it about a week or so ago. And it's taken me a while to get to it, but I kind of felt that a person in my position it needed to be said so with that said can we all be progressives because honestly if you're if you have a problem with it you might if you're questioning all that you need to question yourselves and question your own, own morality because you know people of color are part of this community too so Hey, the ball's in your court. I'm NorCal Nick, leader of the revolutionist movement, and this has been NorCal Corner. Peace and love. <laughs>